can maximize and really leverage that money if you're a powerful dynamic way. But I want to talk to you about that 500, over 500 billion dollars that lies in the hands of black women today. They are telling us that over 85 cents of every one dollar spent by blacks last year was spent at the influence of black women. Now brothers, I'm not saying that y'all don't have any money, but what it means is, girlfriend came up to you and said, honey, we need this. Okay? And if she wasn't saying that, she was managing those household funds in a very powerful way inside the house. Others are estimating that black female power, now with upwards of $565 billion last year alone, and that 62% of the general population versus 55% of the black population are the ones who are making those decisions. Now what they are acknowledging is that any way that you want to look at it, any way you want to cut that economic pie, we have enough money to sustain a lot of these corporations that are marketing to us every single day. One of the arguments that they are advancing is, how can we better appeal to that demographic and have them to buy my product versus someone else's product? I'm going to address that a little bit later. 